and we are back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. Where have you guys been? Where have you been? I've been looking for y'all. I couldn't find you. I've been looking for every single last one of y'all. I could not find you guys. Where have you been? We are back, ladies and gentlemen, for another episode of Breaking Bad. It's been a couple weeks. I know it's been some time. Always a good time to get back into the show. Last episode, if I can remember, Walter had got some good news about his health. He had like a tumor in his chest, but they said it had shrunk down by like 70 or 80%. Uh, him and Jesse had got stranded out in the desert in the RV because Jesse was an idiot and, and left the, the key in the ignition and messed up the battery. But they had cooked up enough meth to make them like over $600,000 a piece. They was up there, they was doing a thing out in the middle of nowhere. Uh, Skylar had started her new job, but we didn't really get anything about that. And uh, Hank and, and Marie, I can't really remember. But look, I guess, look, we'll we'll get back into the next episode. We back, it's all good, we are back, don't worry. If you watching this video, shout out to you. Thank you if you made your way back to this channel. Shout out to you, M look, MVPs of the league. Let's get it, Breaking Bad is back. So we just gonna get straight into it, dog. Last but not least, if you like what you see, hit the like button. We appreciate that. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Leave a comment down below, let me know what you thought. Without further ado, we have Breaking Bad. Breaking Beezy. I know some of y'all love that. Let's get it. Bye. All right, man, we are back. Once again, thank you guys. If you if you if you watching this, shout out to you. MVPs of the league. And they throwing us back in once again. They've started a handful of episodes off with this scene dating back to I want to say the beginning of this season or the end of last season. Hopefully, we're just gonna get closer to to what the hell happened. Cause we've seen this little bear a couple of times now. So you're gonna see what we got. I wonder if something blew up or something caught on fire. You know, com look, combustion. It has to be combustible and, and combast. <laughs> nah. But they've color popped this bear. So I feel like this bear has to have some kind of significance. And this is, look, this is uh, Walter's cyber truck. The windows is smashed. We got a couple body bags. Look. And the class all said together, we back, ladies and gentlemen. Breaking bad, breaking bad, breaking bad. <laughs> we back, we back, we back. <laughs> but I'm really curious to know what happened because now that I've seen two body bags, the hell is going on? <coughs> it's, it look, it's so good to see everybody's faces again. My man Walt got the inhaler now. So in the last episode, they said his, his health was getting better. His tumor had went down, but I still think, I mean, of course he's not cancer free or anything, but I still think it's not a, uh, it's not going to be great. That inhaler really seems to be doing the trick. Just take the rest of the week, please. My girl Skylar. I want you well for the weekend. Well for the weekend. Look what we got going on. It's just a little get together. That's all. Sunday afternoon, maybe, you know, nothing too big. Just family okay. and a few friends. We got a lot to celebrate, don't you think? She's really happy about his his health getting better. I mean, as she should, you know. It's good to see people smiling and, and, and being happy in the show because a lot of the time, that's not the case. What are you supposed to do today? Nothing. Nothing. He owes me. Brownie points for taking a nap. Another food take. Brownies, the, the brownies with nuts are it's infinitely better than brownies without nuts. Oh my God. Like that's not even if, if you have a brownie without nuts or almonds, whatever you want to call them, throw them away. They're trash. Sorry. Even a little cosmic brownies with the little, whatever them things is that you can buy trash nuts only. <laughs> now my question is, is he going to stay inside the house all day or is he going to find a way to, uh, find something to get into? Look at him. I'm bored. Who you gonna call, dog? Oh yeah, his hands his hand was messed up from punching the thing. I was like, yo, what's wrong with his hands? Damn. Can you meet? Ooh. Yes. We're leaving the house. Cat. Come on, man. 
My man Jesse. Oh my God, it's like a, it's like a, it's, it's all coming back. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm looking for. <laughs> Is that I have radiation pneumonitis. Damn pneumonitis. What, what about the old pneumonitis? Oh, I kid, I kid. The news is all good. Like good, good. What do you mean like remission good? Yeah, yay. Yeah. It's been a significant reduction in the tumors. I wonder what made his his tumor shrink. I honestly think it might have something to do with him inhaling this meth fumes, the meth fumes and stuff. It has to be, bro. It's got to be. That's what I want to believe. Oh, hey, I almost forgot. What is this? We'll take our time and stay cautious. And mm. Sell off what we have. Walter seeming he's seeming really uh like reserved or I'm done. He's very cautious. Oh, he's done. I wonder what's what's going through his mind, what's gotten to him to make him, you know, want to get out so quick. <laughs> Look at my man Hank. Hank. Does make one mean margarita. <laughs> hey. <laughs> we are so excited about the future. Hey, how about the man of the hour? Speech. <laughs> when I got my diagnosis, I said to myself, why me? The other day when I got the good news, he said, why me again? <laughs> said the same thing. Oh, shit. <laughs> I, was, I, was just, I was just being funny, but yeah. Fuck. Hey, we appreciate it. We appreciate the honesty, bro. Enjoy. Hey. You know, I absolutely love that, bro. I hate when you get up and do speeches in front of people and you have to say the right thing and say little stuff that's going to make people smile and laugh. Like, fuck that. Go up there and tell the truth. If you really felt like, why me? Then why me? You the one with the cancer. They don't know what you're going through. They don't know how to tell you how to feel, if that makes sense. Tortuga, bean speak for tortoise, okay? Hey, uh, uh, top me off there, will you, buddy? I guess, yeah, poetic, it was poetic. Is that big accident gonna happen at this party right here? Oh, he's giving his son a drink. Fuck it. Go ahead. Drink up. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> we are drinking Mescal stupid, but uh, hey, ooh, ooh. brother, he don't give a fuck. <laughs> it's 16. We going for father of the year. <laughs> We're celebrating. Huh. It's a celebration. Look, drink up, be merry. But it's clearly something inside of Walter that's, that's bothering him or that's getting to him. <laughs> And this motherfucker's pouring up more fucking tequila. Ooh, yes. Nah, nah. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't condone this, bro. Think we've been bogarting this puppy long enough. Bring the bottle back. Oh my god. Look, you're causing a scene. Dude. My son. My bottle. My house. Oh, he's called. Uh oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That shit was funny. Hank said, What are you doing? Going for Father of the Year? <laughs> that shit was hilarious. Wow. Uh. Hey, girl. <laughs> so, what are you up to today? Working? I'm all yours. Now look, you can't get too caught up in love. That's how you get distracted. You know what I'm saying? That gets your mind going in all types of places. We need you to be, we need you to be locked in, Jesse. And put on some pants, please. So I can talk about them. I, I'm not exactly sure who that was yesterday, but it wasn't me. I'm sorry. Something got a hold of him. I wonder what's going on with him, man. I mean, of course, always he has a lot on his plate, but what is it now, currently? The basement flooded? That new hot water heater. Wow, who brought the churros? Oh, that would be me. <laughs> Damn, nigga, did she say you could have one? 
So they just came in and, and just took one of one of one of the churro. I've never had a churro before. What do they taste like? Feel free to bring these anytime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but how about we ask before we take next time, Dick? Got some real beauts. Mm. But Bob, I feel like if your name is Bob, you have to be bald. It's it like it 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 only it's only right. I mean, the good ones will really run up your price though. Uh, it's not an issue. That's what I like to hear. Oh, like you didn't see that. Take that back. And this guy, what's his superpower? That's a uh, Kanga man. If I had a superpower, it would be mind reading. Cause I just, I just be wanting to know what people be thinking sometimes. Not even, it don't even have to be anything about me. Just what the hell are you thinking about? Cause a lot of y'all be having, well, whatever. Where? Who is this? Hey, hold up. Where are you? Jane. She ain't had no business being over here. Woo. We are back. We are officially back. I was waiting on it. I've been waiting on it since this damn episode started. We are officially back. Did y'all not see this motherfucker's pants he was putting on? Holy shit. <laughs> hey, yeah. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hi, honey. Yeah, sorry, I was working. I had my headphones on. Some lunch? Sure, yeah. Her nose is pretty decent. It's like A tier, S tier. This is the new tenant. I'm sorry, did you need something? Ooh, yes. She acting like we don't know, homeboy. That's when he should have just put his arm around her and been like, uh, who's this, babe? Them fucking pants. Look at them fucking pants. Are y'all fucking kidding me? You know you missed it. I'm back. I'm back, goddammit. I know y'all missed it. Look at them pants. My God. Oh, so maybe it was the hot water heater that, that blew up. Finally, hot water. No more toxic waste. Wanna take her for a spin? Uh-oh. Hopefully, look, hopefully this goes well. Even though I know something's gonna happen. Alright, let her rip! 117,000 BTUs. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. That's a lot of BTUs, bro. And the energy savings. I mean, now. Oh, 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 careful, careful, careful. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Huh. Yeah, damn, BTUs got them. Heard they'll take your skin off if you leave it in the, under the water too long. Uh, I'm sorry about the pool. No, 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 that, that was not your fault, not at all. Your old man embarrassed himself, and I owe you an apology, most of all. Having you drink in the first place, it was... It was not right. And for that, I'm, I'm very sorry. We were going for father of the year and we got a little carried away. I'm pretty sure he does feel bad about that though. Like he was acting clearly out of, out of sorts that day, but him doing that for his son or doing that to his son, making him drink, that had to be bad. And I'm assuming he's mad that Jane didn't acknowledge him as her uh friend close friend dear friend boyfriend hey uh yeah. is she just about to walk in here like nothing went on oh hell no come on now we got to talk about this what was that all about let's get it if anything i was doing you a favor there's no deal i was helping you out okay protecting you you acted like you didn't even know me Ooh, so yes so you think I'm going to be all like, hey, dad, meet the stoner guy who lives next door. And by the way, I'm sleeping with him. That's all you think you're doing. Mm, mm, mm. She's keeping him in the dark, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> all right, I'm talking about us, you and me. Who's you and me? Oh, damn. Mm. I'm out of here. She got to apologize, bro. She a little out of line. She's a little out of line. You're keeping my man in the dark. And that's just not cool. Because he clearly likes this girl. That's why I look. The love is just, it just fucking sucks. It sucks. The hip hop music that they play in this show is like the most, I can't even describe it properly, but it's, it's just the most stereotypical like gangster hip hop if you know what i mean 
It's urban. <laughs> like word, yo. <laughs> Let me give it up. I'm gonna give it up. <laughs> So he's going to go underneath this and, and probably don't know what the hell he doing. And this is probably is what's going to cause that situation that we seen. Dad. <laughs> I was waiting for him to stop. What are you doing? We've got rot fungus and it is on a rampage. Cut it out and start fresh. Ask him where he gets the suit and the mask from. Look at this nigga. I still ain't forgot about this dude. Bro trying to be, he, he slick, he slick. The whole time in the back of my mind, I know what he doing. Um, can I just ask um, the Keller account? Uh, the invoice was never presented to accounts receivable. Yeah, we'll figure it out tomorrow. Or not. <laughs> She's not making eye contact. What does this mean? Jesus. <sighs> oh no. No, I'm, I'm fine. <clears throat> What's wrong? It's hormones. Honestly, it happens all the time. <laughs> Look at him. Look at... Nothing's really changed. It's just postponed. There's supposed to be a light at the end of the tunnel. Lately, it just feels like... More tunnel. I was... I, uh, this guy. I just know he's a, he's a dog. He's a dog. He's a dog in the worst way. And she might be a dog too, but being that rock takes everything you got. I'm just watching these two dog. Look at this. This is the shit that I be talking about. If you, if you know, you know, bro. If you know, you know, dog, nigga, dog, my God. The, the two-hander. Dog nigga. Ain't he married too? Hey, that joint look good, bro. Can we just talk about for a second how trash watermelon is? Watermelon is trash. The stereotype is not real. That shit is garbage. It tastes, believe it or not, watermelon tastes like water. And it's like, duh, of course. But this shit tastes like edible water, and it's it's not good. One of the worst fruits of all time. Are you going to work today? Finally, there's rot. More tension. We can feel more tension building. You know what I'm saying? Going back. It might uh, build up to some kind of explosion, literally. I don't know what the hell happened. Damn, bro. Jane really has this man twisted. Apology, girl. I don't know, bro. She might have to do a little bit better than that. She was on some bull. She was on. She was on that BS. She had to buy me some. She had to buy me lunch or something, dinner or something. But apology, girl. That's not a bad start, you know. Thing won't run around this last month. All right, we'll take care of that tomorrow. Right. Okay. Now look at her. She got the shoulders out. I, look, look, ladies and gentlemen. She's showing skin. She's showing. Right. I don't like this. Look. Oh damn. Damn, clumsy dog, they're dogs. And I was just, I, I was just starting to liking this woman. But you know what? We'll just, we'll just let the show go. We'll let it play out. He about to get something that he really don't have no business getting, is it? The hell is this? Look at his pants. Ah, oh, look, nah, nah. He don't do it like Jesse. Sorry, dog. You don't get to just throw on a baggy pair of, of, of jeans, bro, and, and think you it. And don't buy everything in one place. Do it piecemeal. Different items, different stores. I 
attracts less attention. Bro, giving him the game. Yeah, bro. It's a zero on the pants, bro. Yeah. And he's just leaving. Bro, I thought you needed that stuff for the house, bro. Where are you going? Oh, God. What is he about to do? Stay out of my territory. Yes, 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 ladies and gentlemen. The fuck? This is beginning to feel like a lot. And look at them, bro. They are fake ass Walter and Jesse, bro. You can't just throw a bald headed guy and a and a guy with big pants and a and a beanie on, bro. This is beginning to feel like a lot. Look at him. Stay off his territory. Look, Walter White, nigga. That was another episode of Breaking Bad. Like I said, it's good to be back. And we picking up right where we left off. I guess we're getting closer to this big explosion incident situation is going on. Um, I'm thinking it's going to have to do something with the hot water heater or whatever that's going on under the house. And speaking of that, my man Walter has completely thrown himself, thrusted himself into that work. Um, they had a big little party or get together, gathering, whatever you want to call it for the, uh, the celebration of his, his remission or his, his tumors going down or whatnot. And he was just clearly, you could tell something was bothering him. He was making his kid drink alcohol and he threw up and he was just being, he was, he was being a, he, look, he was being a bad boy. Um, he apologized and stuff, but you could clearly tell something was going on. Um, scholar, she's at work and she's a dog. And the and I think his name is Ted. He's a dog too. They know what they're doing. We gonna keep. We're gonna keep our eyes. I got four. We're gonna keep our eyes close on those two because look, she knocking over stuff on purpose to get them to come in the room. Like, come on now, come on. You know, Jesse and Jane. They had some friction in their relationship. She was acting fake, like she ain't know who homeboy was, and she wants to draw apology girl. Like, nah, bro. You gonna you gonna have to give us a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? Look, ease up on the rent next month. You know, that'll really make me start to come around if I was Jesse. But uh, we back with Jesse. Look, it was good to see the pants again. And then we had that fraud, right? We had that fraud at the end trying to wear some pants and, and, and wear a Jesse Pinkman outfit. And we had a bald dude and they had a little fake ass RV. Them niggas got Jesse and Walter from Timu at the end of the episode. And my man Walt had to tell him, look, stay off my property, dog. Stay off the, look, stay away. Like, this is my shit. I'll run this. You know what I'm You got to get out. Get away. And clearly, you could tell it was some tension between Walter and Skylar and just a whole little family in that scene where he had, you know, came and got the toast or whatnot. It's just, it's, it's some stuff going on. You know what I'm saying? Hank and Walter had kind of had a little standoff. It, it, it's, some, it's some tension going on. It's some emotions being felt. And God damn it, that's what this show is. And we're back. And I absolutely love it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, that's pretty much going to do it for this one. If you made it this far, we clap it up for you. Y'all are the MVPs of the motherfucking league. 60 points, touchdowns, home runs, and hat tricks out the ass. All of that good stuff. We back. Um, it's good to be back. Last but not least, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, um, all that good stuff. And for Breaking Bad, Season 2, Episode 10, we almost at the season finale. That's all that I got.